Hi guys, it's our really movie new. Hi Mama, but I have a new YouTube channel. No it's the same one. The like you can still type Sam Wilson and it will show up, but when you put on my YouTube, when you click on my YouTube vid, um, channel, it will say Pigeon vs. High Dragon. Because that's my new YouTube channel, the same one. Um, I watched some YouTube videos last night to see how to make a double, how to make a second YouTube channel, and I know how to do it. So give me 100 subscribers for a game, for a game channel. So yeah, and we are taking Kenny to a jail practice, and it's competition, and yeah. That's what makes it so and, um, compelling. It is a muscular Christianity. It is a yeah. Tell me in the comments if you watch my videos and you have a YouTube channel. If, if you are a girl or a boy, tell me in the comments if you do chill practice or competition practice. I know some boys does it, but I don't. I don't. And by the way, this video will not be that long because I made a video to Kenny's competition, my practice. And guess what? It was 36 minutes long, guys. And um, this is the channel that is only just like Will Song Wilson. It was 36 minutes long, and they didn't let me to post it because they said, they said it was too long. So I will probably make this video like 10 minutes long, not that long. But guys, it's not 36 minutes long anymore. Now let's just be clear in this way. It is. 5.41 And Jace is screaming! See? Yeah. And yeah, Jace is crying now. Okay, I'm pretty tired. I did a lot of work at school today. So, I will just go to sleep. Every time we go to Kenny's Platics, I... Uh, almost every time I go to the school, I learn from school, too, I just get tired from anything. Yeah. You guys, a couple more minutes. Uh. Around 5 o'clock in the evening, he was stopped by a sergeant as he was getting ready to leave the barracks. And the sergeant said, soldier, where are you going? And he said, I'm going home for my tea. And the sergeant said, no, you're not. You just joined the army. Get your get in here. He didn't realize he thought you just got a uniform and then do what you want. That's that's that, that's I think the, the the notion that's dawned on a number of us. Or you just sign up and then do what you want. No, you don't sign up and do what you want. You sign up and do what he says. That's devotion. Devotion. <laughs> that was you just a point for you guys. You thought I was actually sleeping. You thought I was actually sleeping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know whether they like something or whether they're devoted to it. It's interesting, but in 1 Corinthians 7, in the authorized version, the word that is used oh, he is, is not me. the form of this world, but, but I will actually go to sleep, okay, okay. The fashion is that they are no longer, we are no longer conformed to the fashions of this world. That doesn't mean you wear different kinds of clothes. It means that the things that frame the natural man, which are circumscribed by time, which have no eternal dimension to them, these are no longer the things that marshal, that uh, stir, that direct the life of the individual. Because now there's a whole new thing. Fine, okay. Dimension, to our interpersonal relationships, to our material possessions, to our temporal okay. activities. Devotion to the commanding officer. Now, let me just take you into the next one and then we'll stop. There is a clear line of command for the soldier and there are rules for the athlete. There are rules for the athlete. 
So the second word is the word discipline. And I think that is inherent in the verse, isn't it? An athlete is not crowned unless he competes according to the rules. Now, be careful on this because Paul is not describing here self-imposed rules of discipline. He talks in other places about self-discipline. But he's identifying the fact that in the games of that time, whether it was the Isthmian games or whatever it was, there were actually rules that had to be adhered to both in the training program for being in the games and then for participating in the games themselves. And so he picks up that picture and he says an athlete could never be crowned unless he competes according to the rules. Some of you remember Ben Johnson, 1997-1998, two consecutive years, he said... So that will be it for this video. See you guys tomorrow. Peace out.